Ahoy, esteemed guest of the fourth season. Welcome to this grandiose gathering where fate has brought us together for tales both tall and true. Today, we embark on a journey, not just across oceans, but across boundless realms of possibility. Here amidst the laughter of friends, we celebrate, we celebrate <laughs> the spirit of adventure that courses through every player's veins and every explorer's heart. But beware, my hearty companions, for in the sea of revelry lies hidden treasure of knowledge, camaraderie, and an unknown number of deaths. <laughs> so raise your tankardless arms to the bravest of us who deign to chart out to the new horizons laid before us. <laughs> Gather round me, hearties, hoist the sails of imagination, and set the course for a season of merriment. Let the winds of Destiny fill our metaphorical sails, guiding us through a voyage untold. And so, with that rousing speech from Sunny Spacecraft, we are officially kicking off Season 4 here on the Unorthoblox server. Welcome back, everyone. We are here on the Unorthoblox server, and we're back to basics with a brand new season. So we have no resources, no tools, no nothing. So off we set to get, uh, we gotta get geared up now. So as I start, of course, I'm immediately attacked by a baby zombie and killed. So that, that's a good way to start off season four. So after that little restart, um, I headed out from spawn. So I've been gathering wood, food, anything else I could find laying around. So my initial plan was to kind of generally head south to my location because I picked out a a main base for this season, it's, it's off to the southeast of spawn. And then if I run into anyone else, we'll see what we can do. But, of course, as soon as I set off, I got lost. So, I headed off to the south, and then kind of got turned around and went east, and then went north, and went south, and west, and north. And I basically ran around in circles for a while. Because every time I run one direction, run into a zombie or a skeleton or something, once I get done, I forget to look at my map to know where I'm going. So then I just head off in another direction that looks good and realize that, oh, I'm not going where I need to go. So I did get a lot of supplies. I explored a number of caves. I climbed mountains, crossed deserts, and slogged through dense swamps. And eventually I reached my destination. Okay, after getting lost, I think I finally found my way back. Or not my way back, but found my main base for the season. I have picked an area. It wasn't far from original spawn. We have a spawn. We have spawn over there, but we moved it. So it's way over there. So it added an extra bit of travel for me. I didn't realize there was that far away. It didn't look that far on the map when I picked it. So let's see if we can get her over this hill. through these beautiful flowers. And right here, this little village is mine. I've claimed it. I'm the king of the village. So, this is where I'm going to be doing my stuff for this season. Now they got lost and found. 
yeah, I kind of was chasing, chasing animals and got in the wrong direction. But now, I am back where I belong. So this is going to be the main area. So I've got this village here, which I'm going to tear down and retransform. I've got some buildings I'm going to do over there. I've got a plan for this. So it's kind of this square area here with the little flowers on, the, the cherry trees on top. Oh, in this, I'm claiming this because this is uh, almost uh, almost a pre. I've only got one, two, three, like four or five blocks I need to remove out of there and rebuild it. But I almost got myself a full Nether portal. And it's going to be above ground this year, not underground. So even though I'm going to tear this village down and rebuild it, I think I need to build myself a starter house, or at least a temporary, temporary house here to keep my stuff in. And I think I'm going to redo this one right here. It's got a nice little area down here. I can put my uh, my furnace and my craft my crafting bench and my furnace in here. I've got an area over here I can put some uh, boxes and I've got a furnace up here and I think I'm going to put like my bed there. So now I have my spawn point. But I need more room so I'm going to have to expand this. So I think I'm going to, yeah I think I can go off this wall. If I make a door through here, I hate to hate to take that window out. Maybe I'll I'll expand it. I think I'll expand it out this way. Oops. I'm gonna need uh, I'm gonna need some supplies. Let's get rid of this. I gathered up quite a bit of food, quite a bit of logs as I was going along, so I just sort of went on a big hunting trip coming over here. I'm going to put this in the water. I don't need it over here, but I could use it in the water. So we'll let, it, uh, let it take entity space up. Okay, I need to do a little mining. I have not gone underground to do any mining, so that could be a problem.
There we go. Have my expansion on there. Like I said, this house is going to go away. Because eventually all this needs to be down at level 67. Yeah. I think everything needs to be down at least this far from here that way. And that way. So everything needs to be leveled off. So this will all be gone someday. Hopefully someday before the end of the season. <laughs> I mean, it is the start of the season, but... I'm I've got a, a lot of dirt to move. But this, for a temporary place, I've got this set up. So I've got, I moved my smoker down so I've got a better bed. These guys have been trying to take over my bed. So I need to uh, add a few more beds around here just to keep people uh, out of my stuff. I've got my, my furnace, my smoker, some chests. And then over here is just a storage area. So I'm going to put a bunch of chests and stuff over here. I had to I had to lose that one window, but at least I've got this. Uh, I was able to get uh, glass so I could make my own windows. So we got nice, got windows in here. So it's pretty, uh, very modest abode. Let's see, right there we go. And for the start of the season, that's how it usually is. At least it's not a, a, you know, a dirt hut in the wall. I've had those before. So I've really not explored a lot of this village. I've just sort of been gathering supplies to build my house. So we have him, a cleric. Oh, I can get redstone from this guy. Perfect. Because I may need some redstone. I did check the uh, chest over by the portal and there's like nothing. You know, they don't do a good job of setting this up. I think it makes sense to me if I get rid of this. Can I pick that? Oh, I've got a, I don't have an iron pick, so I'm not going to touch that right now. I think, I think I need an iron pick to pick that up without causing ruin. So I'm going to wait till I got iron pick or iron and diamond. This house doesn't have much in it. What's this house got? This house has another smoker. Okay, a little bit of lag there. I get lag every once in a while, so it's not as bad as it was. We did a little bit of server tweaking. So the lag is not nearly as bad as it used to be. Oh, cool. I got a blast furnace. Of course, all this is going to be my supplies once I get done. Let's do... There. We'll just redirect that down to the creek. So really, nah, nothing so far. I haven't found a single chest yet. Let's... Uh, Let's check these t cities, or not these cities, these houses over here. Nothing. How about these up on the hill? There's a chest with mm, not much in it. I'll need those for the farms, but... Nothing in there. Let me uh, do this. There. Maybe that'll make it easier for them to get up here and use these beds. That one there. This one's probably the same. And then... I do have a shovel. Let's use my shovel. There. Nothing in there. We've got this guy way up on the top here. See anything? No, just the bed. 
So overall, as a village, this is pretty pitiful. There's like hardly any chests. Just a few things here and there, a few villagers. So I'm gonna have to, gonna have to spruce it up a bit. But like all this is gonna go down to level 67. So we'll be at this level. So there's a lot of dirt I need to move and reorder around here. I'll fill this up. I think I'm going to have a two tier. I think I'm, I'm going to have one tier running just a block above. Or maybe level one. No, a block, I'll do a block above the water. So then I'll make this, turn this into like a dock. We'll have a small wall here. Well, I think that kind of wraps things up for today. I'll uh, continue uh, cleaning up things and getting things ready for uh, building some stuff. I got a few things we're going to hit in the next episode. But I um, uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you have a great day. Oh, and make sure you check out all the other Unorthoblox server members. I've got links to their videos in the description below what you're watching now. So until next time, have a great day and I'll see you later. Bye bye.